Restaurant Brands International Inc., the parent company of Burger King, has unveiled plans to acquire Carol's Restaurant Group Inc., its largest U.S. franchisee, in a substantial cash deal amounting to about $1 billion. This strategic move is aimed at accelerating a comprehensive overhaul of numerous Burger King locations with the ultimate goal of reclaiming customer loyalty and boosting the brand's competitiveness in the fast food industry. The acquisition process is anticipated to be finalized by the second quarter, with an additional investment of $500 million earmarked specifically for the remodeling of over 600 out of Carol's extensive network of more than 1,000 locations. Once the renovations are completed, Burger King intends to initiate the refranchising of the majority of these stores to either new or existing smaller franchise owners. This ambitious restructuring project is anticipated to unfold over a span of five to seven years. The broader strategy behind this acquisition aligns with Restaurant Brands International Incorporated's ongoing commitment to investing in cutting-edge technology, ramping up advertising expenditures, and elevating the overall customer experience within its establishments. These measures are designed to revitalize foot traffic and counteract the declining sales trends that have been observed in recent years. Notably, the company had already disclosed an initial $400 million investment in September 2022 as part of its overarching revitalization strategy. Following the announcement, Carol's Restaurant Group Incorporated's shares experienced a notable surge, soaring as much as 14% in pre-market trading before a temporary halt. Meanwhile, restaurant brands' shares remain steady in pre-market trading, having achieved a 21% increase in 2023, surpassing the 11% rise in the New York Stock Exchange's composite index during the same period. The agreed-upon terms of the deal involve restaurant brands International Inc. paying $9.55 per share for all Carol's shares not currently held by the acquiring company or its affiliates. This acquisition price reflects a substantial 23% premium compared to Carroll's 30-day volume-weighted average price as of the previous Friday.